was early January and we must have been absolutely mad. The Vale of Glamorgan Karate Organisation take their training very seriously. On this occasion, all four of us took up their challenge to join them in a session that we had been told had a sting in the tail. We divided into four groups. Mine was led by black belt instructor Andrew Kanias. Block across, so your hands come in inside here. Block. OK, so from there, block. Itch! Itch! Bring through and push on the third move. Knee! Knee! OK, so if you put more of your weight on the back there, so Simon, that's it. On this leg? That's it, bend that leg. Bring this knee out of it this way. I've learned actually why we shout. We shout because everything comes from the stomach. Okay, so you have to shout from the stomach. Uh. You can join as young as six, but you only really get going when you're a teenager. It's not aggressive though, it's just defensive. <laughs> Protecting yourself. Okay. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> yes! We were nicely tuned up, but nothing could prepare us for what was to come. <laughs> Karate is all about discipline, and that meant ignoring the cold and focusing on the moves. Easier said than done when the air temperature is several degrees below. Well, this is certainly something you don't see on Barry Beach every day of the year, especially when it's winter. A whole load of people down here in their karate gear to try out a few moves on a freezing cold beach in the middle of winter. Tell you what, Sam, my toes are a bit nippy. <laughs> Mine are, I actually can't feel my toes. It's frozen. We'll do it. <laughs> When it's this cold, it's definitely mind over matter. Oh, it was kicking off there, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, no, in a weird way, I really enjoyed that. Yeah. Aww.